Hi, and welcome to our next video. In this video, we are going to set up Visual Studio Code in the live server. Open up your browser. I'm using Firefox, and in the search bar, type VS Code Download. Then you press Enter. Then on top of the search results, you will see code.visualstudio.com download. Click this one. Then this window will be shown to you. I'm using Windows, so I'm going to click the Windows. If you're using Linux, click this one. And if you're using Mac, click the Mac one. So let's click Windows. Right, so we're going to the next link. A pop-up menu appears with the setup. If you don't see this, then you click here, direct download link. Right. For us it did, so let me click save file. Then we click yes. We click on the progress bar, it's already downloading there. So then we click on that one. So we're gonna get the setup instructions. Right, so we say accept. We click next, click next again. Since I already installed Visual Studio Code on my computer, this menu is showing for me, but for you it won't. So I'll just click the yes. So now we're just gonna click next. This is important. On the under other, make sure you check these four checkboxes are checked. And if they are, just if they're not, just check them. And then once you finish that, we click next. All right. And then we can click the install. All right. Now that is all done. You see this launch Visual Studio code. Just make sure you uncheck the checkbox because we're not finished yet. So uncheck it. So we click finish. So minimize your browser. Then on your desktop, right click say new folder so in the new folder we're going to type in training whatever you feel like you're comfortable with and what you will know you can remember for me i'm just going to put here course so once i'm finished that then i can right click the folder and i say open with vs code All right, now that we open up our folder in Visual Studio Code, we're almost there. So only thing left is the live server extension. So on our left hand side, you'll see the Explorer, search bar, GitHub, run command, and your extensions. You click on the extensions. So right here, you type in the search extension in the marketplace, you type live server. First one should appear. Just check it's for Ritwick today. You click on this one and you'll get this window over here on your right hand side and you click install. And that's it. You're all done. So now we close this window and we go back to the Explorer. Click this icon here. And then you will see this course folder right there. And that's it. Um, in the next video, we will continue learning the basics of HTML and congratulations for making it this far. And thanks for watching and I'll see you there.